one. Measles just doesn't make you sick once. The vast majority of cases are in kids who are unvaccinated, as you well know, or have an unknown vaccination status, doctor. So we've heard from experts rely on your pediatrician for guidance. But as a physician, I'd love to know from you, when the onus is placed on a pediatrician or on a doctor to convince your patient to take a vaccine when you don't really have that support from the federal government, what is that like? Well, there's only so much you can do in a 15 minute pediatrician visit. I know I know this well because both my mom and my wife are pediatricians. And uh, so I, I'm, I'm close to the field. There's only so much you can do. Um, let's just quickly emphasize a few points that I know pediatricians across the country want to make sure emphasize one measles just doesn't make you sick once. Ariel, you know, you saw this in South Carolina. There's something called Im immune amnesia. Mm -hmm. If you get impacted, especially if you're a child and you get infected with the measles, it can actually wipe out your immune system's memory against prior infections, prior vaccinations, making you more vulnerable for another different type of infection. It causes immune amnesia. And we don't talk enough about that. So that's number one. Parents out there need to be aware that this actually creates greater vulnerability for your child against all all forms of infection. Contagious for up to two hours after somebody that's infected leaves a room. And three, the medically fragile and those under 12 months of age are especially at risk because they're not fully vaccinated.